what a brag book was, and I had a couple people ask me to explain that in a video what exactly a brag book is and how to prepare it. So a brag book is a folder or a binder or some piece that you can buy at Office Depot or um, Office Max and you put it together to use during the interview process to help um, clarify your skill sets and set you apart from the competition so that you get a job offer. The brag book can include uh, letters of recommendation, attaboy notes, no offense ladies, but uh, maybe the emails that you receive from uh, your boss or from, from someone, someone another division saying what a great job you did, please keep those, uh, print out a good copy of those. Uh, in sales it could be stack rankings, uh, annual reviews, but be careful. If you present four years out of five of annual reviews, everyone's going to wonder why you didn't go ahead and present that fifth year. So even if it's not the uh, glowing recommendation that you got on the other four, you need to go ahead and uh, submit it so that there's not that um, sort of white elephant in the room wondering what exactly was on that review. Um, it could be a copy of a rewards uh, letter that you received. Uh, it does need to have a copy of your resume. Uh, perhaps it would have technical experiences. Um, on my brag book, I always had a list of all the different types of lab equipment that I had uh, used or marketed in my career. Uh, it could be certifications. Perhaps you've done the Six Sigma course or some other uh, educational course. Uh, perhaps it's some uh, weekend MBA program that you've taken some specific course on biotechnology or whatever it is. Uh, in the sales role, it could be a financial presentation that you put together that was pretty impressive or a PowerPoint presentation inside of there. Uh, it might have copies of articles that you wrote, uh, pub publications you wrote. Maybe if you're in designing or, or Marcom, maybe it's an actual brochure that you helped develop. Um, if you're just getting out of college, you may want to include your college transcript. I don't think that's appropriate once you've already had your first job outside of college. Um, I read some articles and on, on one of the articles that said the background check and the credit history, unless you're applying at the casino, I'm not sure that I think that that's relevant or something that you want to um, have as part of your job criteria. Um, this, this living, breathing document, this brag book, um, you should have it where you can leave some copy of it with the managers uh, that you interview with. It might not be possible to, if it's pretty large, you might not be able to do that and you can say, look, I'd be one, more than willing to share uh, this with you and show it to you, walk them through it. Remember what we said about if you have something like this, if you don't take the time to really demonstrate it and, and show the power of it to the, uh, to the interviewer, you may not get a second chance. Or um, you might say, look, if there's anything in there that's of interest to you that you'd like to have a copy of, I'd be more than willing to get that for you. But what the Bragg book demonstrates is initiative, professionalism, organization, of course all the things that are demonstrated by the various documents. It also uh, demonstrates a clear understanding of marketing and, and selling, how to market yourself and sell yourself and hopefully that would translate to their product if you were um, hired. But it's really just that little bit, that 10% between good and great if you will, that the brag book does for you and that is it really sets you apart from your competition I, even if they bring a brag book, whether it has the depth, the scope, the professional appearance that yours has, could be the uh, determining back factor between whether you're the number one candidate to go to the final interview or they are. So I hope this helps really explain what the brag book is and the power of it. If you have any questions, you're certainly uh, welcome to comment or email me at Peggy at PHC Consulting. Uh, I am an executive recruiter and I specialize in sales, marketing, sales management and technical support for the medical and laboratory industries. Please check out our website at www.phcconsulting.com and if you think this has been valuable to you in your job search, please share this with others. Thanks so much.